A very good afternoon Dutch bike blogger. Thank you for riding with me. Today, Friday, December 18th. Twenty twenty that is. It's a nice day. It's just turned thirteen twenty five or so. And I'm on my bike again. Nice weather. It's about seven or eight degrees. There is although a little a bit of wind or a little bit there is wind. Four ball four from the south, which makes it actually feel a little bit colder than it actually is. I am wearing gloves, no hat at the moment. I do have a hat with me, so something I could put on if necessary. But for the time being, not not needed. Bumpy road. Fun fact: there is a car and there is a car behind me. <laughs> Always struggling. turn here should be possible and it is nothing wrong with it there is a hint of sunshine this morning there was drizzle at least chance of drizzle I did not go outside so I didn't notice but Saw it in weather, weather forecast. And weather forecast is mostly right. Although I've seen things happen that I think to myself, why? Why you tell it's dry and there is rain then? No good. But 90% of the time it's well acceptable. Well, where is Dutch bike blogger going today? Well, first of all, I'm going to go to a location where I was last time. But I'm going to see if the crossing that was reconstructed is now finished. And we will have to see if that has become an improvement. probably stop there and have a look and film a little bit on location so not only drive through there but handheld bike to the side at least that's the plan I don't know when I I'm arriving there what I will be seeing It's not a major overhaul, just a update. short trip what the heck don't understand <laughs> let's turn around man <laughs> this is really odd
somebody put outside a part of a sofa or a long chair, whatever. Some people do strange things with their old furniture. Probably also strange people. Just dumped here. Ridiculous. Bah. And there's a mobile toilet on the side. Idiot with only one headlight. Lucky it's not dark. Well, the crossing. And the reason for the de redoing the crossing is because they're going to extend it through here. This will be a bike lane in that distance. You can see the foundation being laid there. A lot of work. Asphalt is already poured in, but probably has to be redone or something to has to be changed. Where do these cars all come from? You're gonna to wonder. So they made it like you could now of can now go straight. Let's drive a little bit this way. Then make a turn and go over the intersection again. Well change the plans a little wanted to film a handheld but not let's do that let's not do that let's change well it's actually better of course there has to be lines drawn onto the asphalt again signs put up so people know let's go on the sidewalk well you want to redecorate your home there are a pair of chairs for the dinner table and some sleeping arrangement but I have to turn back for something because I saw something on the facade of a building well, not sure if that's going to be in view from here but of kind of things here probably took out the bed sheets and painted them let's have a look what's on there wethouder Broeksema laat ons in de kou staan wethouder van de schaafzellers op de tocht elderman Broeksema lets us be in the cold and another elderman has put it in a windy place I do beginning to suspect that these people are not quite happy with the heating arrangement in their apartment. And also mold. Cold, mold and draft. And it's all about... <laughs> Man. Why don't you tear the 
whole building down and build a new one. It would be, in my opinion, a better option. If it's moldy, it's cold, and it's drafty, then, well, probably there's something wrong with your home. And that will not be fixed by some new heating equipment. Central heating, nope. Otherwise, just to inform you, this is a longer bike tour. Multiple parts again, like always. Multiple short parts. Did not have uh, got any comment about people liking it or not. Do you like a longer video of half an hour or 45 minutes? Or shorter videos? Videos 10 minutes, 11, 12, sort of. I'm actually liking the shorter ones when I see a video on the channel and it's about half an hour or longer. I may decide to watch it, not watch it at all, or put the watching off for another time and then forget about it. Well, other end of the bike lane, all under construction, still still under construction. A lot of water on the air, standing water. But it does look like they extended the bike lane through here, all the way through there, or to there. Let's see. Can we go there? Probably. Probably. By the way, this, when this video comes online, it's probably already next year. I'm a bit behind with uploading. And also, I'm not uploading that frequently anymore. I decided to slow it down a bit. Not sure if that's the best choice, but that's what I did. I can actually see a significant uh, drop in views. Not for the video itself, but because I just don't upload every day anymore. Try to have a schedule from... Like for instance, upload Monday, wait for Tuesday and Wednesday, and then upload on the Thursday again. And then Friday, skip Friday, and Saturday, and then Sunday. So, always two whole days with nothing between the videos. I used to upload every day, weekly, Monday till Friday at 8 o'clock, and in the weekends at 6 o'clock in the evening. But I changed that a little. Actually, a good idea to do so little bit less pressure on putting out a video every day. Suits me fine. Hope you like it too. Less videos. Can't imagine that when every day a video is coming out you have no time to watch it. Because you all have other things to do. Jobs. Children. Significant others. Friends. And so on. I'm now on the Paddenpoelsterweg.
used to me my frequent route to work early in the morning and sometimes in the evening and afternoon I had variable working hours back then last year this year changed a whole lot normally I would go to the left and then go into the Seneca area but not today today going straight I can feel a nice breeze in the back so cycling is going very smooth when I make a 180 degree turn I probably will have wind in my face and be not so happy but well who cares riding around on the bike not done that by the way um, since last Monday the Netherlands the Holland is in a new lockdown due to the COVID-19 virus and the people having con contained it or tested positive roles what that meant is schools are closed fitness facilities are closed non-essential businesses are closed so no shopping for no clothes only supermarkets grocery stores drugstore for medication and all kinds of knickknacks like socks and underwear and that kind of thing but mostly food stores stay open and the rest is closed bit of a downer for people who wanted to shop for Christmas <laughs> on the Monday in the afternoon it was already buzzing on the internet that the shops were closing the next day so on the Monday afternoon there was a run <laughs> at all kinds of shops even food stores groceries while they said they still would be open so not sure what people are thinking buying more toilet paper to add to the collection you already have from March you don't understand man and there is actually enough food for everybody so there will be not a problem really not a problem <laughs> 